Well guys, I'm sure you know where I am right now. I'm saying goodbye to the old girl. And oh, there's me. Um, yeah. I'm gonna do the last cold start, old start, whatever you want to call it on the old girl. Because after this, in the next two weeks or so, she can be picked up for recycling. So, actually I want to show you something. This hole, if you're ever wondering where it came from, is uh, last spring or something. I had an airsoft gun in here that I was working on and uh, the person didn't tell me that it was jammed up. Went to smack it, it released, it said bye bye. And the radio's back to stock, but it's not wired. I just shoved it in there to get rid of it. Gotta take my old papers out and stuff like that. But let's see if the old girl starts. It has been... How long now? It has to have been four or five months. It's just been sitting. Pulled all the wiring, all my CB radio and all that stuff out. Let's see what the old girl does. Uh-huh. I guess it's battery connection. Now let's quickly take a look at it. Because I did just remove the connectors. So I'll twist that. Twist this. Let's see if she starts. I got lights on on the inside. I had the radio going before, so I'm sure the battery's not dead. Let's see again. <laughs> Holy crap. I can hear it hissing away because, ooh, she's not sounding happy. She hasn't been running in a while and she's running on uh, stale gas, so uh, don't be surprised if it stalls. Let's just make sure it's not leaking. Yeah, it's going to stink too much, so I'm not running it long. <sighs> Bye, old girl. On to the next car. But this one's going to be a new one next time. Have a great one, guys, and uh, RIP old vehicle. If you love your old vehicles, like this uh, video. Let me know what you have and stories about your vehicles, because I'd love to hear them. Have a great one, guys. Another great Saturday.